The outer solar system dwarf planet Haumea has two known moons, Hiaka and Namaka, named after Hawaiian goddesses. These small moons were discovered in 2005, from observations of Haumea made at the large telescopes of the W. M. Keck Observatory in Hawaii. Haumea's moons are unusual in a number of ways. They are thought to be part of its extended collisional family, which formed billions of years ago from icy debris after a large impact disrupted Haumea's ice mantle. Hiaka, the larger, outermost moon, has large amounts of pure water ice on its surface, which is rare among Kuiper belt objects. Namaka, about one-tenth the mass, has an orbit with surprising dynamics, it is unusually eccentric and appears to be greatly influenced by the larger satellite. History Two small satellites were discovered around Haumea which was at that time still designated 2003 EL61 through observations using the WM. Keck Observatory by a Caltech team in 2005. The outer and larger of the two satellites was discovered January 26, 2005, and formally designated S-2005-2003 EL61-1, though nicknamed Rudolf by the Caltech team. The smaller, inner satellite of Haumea was discovered on June 30, 2005, formally termed S-2005-2003 EL61-2, and nicknamed Blitzen. On September 7, 2006, both satellites were numbered and admitted into the official Minor Planet Catalog as 136108-2003EL61I and 2, respectively. The permanent names of these moons were announced, together with that of 2003EL61, by the International Astronomical Union on September 17, 2008, 136,108 Haumea I Hiaka and 136,108 Haumea II Namaka. Each moon was named after a daughter of Haumea, the Hawaiian goddess of fertility and childbirth. Haiaka is the goddess of dance and patroness of the Big Island of Hawaii, where the Mauna Kea Observatory is located. Namaka is the goddess of water and the sea, she cooled her sister Pele's lava as it flowed into the sea, turning it into new land. In her legend, Haumea's many children came from different parts of her body. The dwarf planet Haumea appears to be almost entirely made of rock, with only a superficial layer of ice. Most of the original icy mantle is thought to have been blasted off by the impact that spun Haumea into its current high speed of rotation, where the material formed into the small Kuiper belt objects in Haumea's collisional family. There could therefore be additional outer moons, smaller than Namaka, that have not yet been detected. However, HST observations have confirmed that no other moons brighter than 0.25% of the brightness of Haumea exist within the closest tenth of the distance 0.1% of the volume where they could be held by Haumea's gravitational influence its hill sphere. This makes it unlikely that any more exist. <laughs> <laughs> Surface properties. Hiaka is the outer and, at roughly 350 km in diameter, the larger and brighter of the two moons. Strong absorption features observed at 1.5, 1.65 and 2 micrometers in its infrared spectrum are consistent with nearly pure crystalline water ice covering much of its surface. The unusual spectrum, and its similarity to absorption lines in the spectrum of Haumea, led Brown and colleagues to conclude that it was unlikely that the system of moons was formed by the gravitational capture of passing Kuiper belt objects into orbit around the dwarf planet. Instead, the Haumean moons must be fragments of Haumea itself. The sizes of both moons are calculated with the assumption that they have the same infrared albedo as Haumea, which is reasonable as the spectra show them to have the same surface composition. Haumea's albedo has been measured by the Spitzer Space Telescope. From ground based telescopes, the moons are too small and close to Haumea to be seen independently. Based on this common albedo, the inner moon, Namaka, which is a tenth the mass of Hiaka, would be about 170 km in diameter. The Hubble Space Telescope, HST, has adequate angular resolution to separate the light from the moons from that of Haumea. 
Photometry of the Haumea triple system with HST's NICMOS camera has confirmed that the spectral line at 1.6 micrometers that indicates the presence of water ice is at least as strong in the Moon's spectra as in Haumea's spectrum. The moons of Haumea are too faint to detect with telescopes smaller than about 2 meters in aperture, though Haumea itself has a visual magnitude of 17.5, making it the third brightest object in the Kuiper belt after Pluto and Makemake, and easily observable with a large large amateur telescope. Topic: <inaudible> Orbital characteristics. Hyaka orbits Haumea nearly circularly every 49 days. Namaka orbits Haumea in 18 days in a moderately elliptical, non-Keplerian orbit, and as of 2008 was inclined 13 degrees with respect to Hyaka, which perturbs its orbit. Because the impact that created the moons of Haumea is thought to have occurred in the early history of the solar system, over the following billions of years it should have been tidally damped into a more circular orbit. Namaka's orbit has likely been disturbed by orbital resonances with the more massive Hyaka due to converging orbits as they moved outward from Haumea due to tidal dissipation. They may have been caught in and then escaped from orbital resonance several times, they currently are in or at least close to an 8 to 3 resonance. This resonance strongly perturbs Namaka's orbit, which has a current precession of its argument of periapsis by about minus 6.5 degrees per year, a precession period of 55 years. At present, the orbits of the Haumean moons appear almost exactly edge on from Earth, with Namaka having periodically occulted Haumea from 2009 to 2011. Observation of such transits would provide precise information on the size and shape of Haumea and its moons, as happened in the late 1980s with Pluto and Charon. The tiny change in brightness of the system during these occultations required at least a medium aperture professional telescope for detection. Hyaka last occulted Haumea in 1999, a few years before its discovery, and will not do so again for some 130 years. However, in a situation unique among regular satellites, the great talking of Namaka's orbit by Hyaka preserved the viewing angle of Namaka Haumea transits for several more years. Topic: <laughs> Namaka. Namaka is the smaller inner moon of the dwarf planet Haumea. It is named after Namaka, the goddess of the sea in Hawaiian mythology and one of the daughters of Haumea. Topic: <inaudible> Discovery. Namaka was discovered on the 30th of June 2005 and announced on the 29th of November 2005. It was nicknamed Blitzen by the discovery team before being assigned an official name. Topic: <laughs> Physical characteristics. Namaka is only 1.5% as bright as its parent dwarf planet Haumea and is about 0.05% its mass. If it turns out to have a similar albedo, it would be about 170 kilometers in diameter. Photometric observations indicate that its surface is made of water ice. Mutual events between 2009 and 2011 were expected to improve the knowledge of the orbits and masses of the components of the Haumean system, but interpreting those observations was greatly complicated by the unexpected non-tidally locked spin state of Hyaka. Further observations of Hyaka might allow to determine its rotation period and spin state more precisely, at which point it should be possible to remove its effect from the data obtained in 2009. Hyaka <laughs> <laughs> Hyaka <Hiyaka. laughs> is the larger, outer moon of the dwarf planet Haumea. Topic. Discovery and naming Hyaka was the first satellite discovered around Haumea. It is named after one of the daughters of Haumea, Hyaka, the patron goddess of the Big Island of Hawaii, though at first it had gone by the nickname, Rudolph, by its discovery team. 
It orbits once every 49.12 plus or minus 0.03 d at a distance of 49,880 plus or minus 198 kilometers, with an eccentricity of 0.0513 plus or minus 0.0078 and an inclination of 126.356 plus or minus 0.064 degrees. Topic. Physical characteristics Topic Size and brightness Its measured brightness is 5.9 plus or minus 0.5%, translating into a diameter of about 22% of its primary or in the range of 320 kilometers, assuming similar infrared albedo. To put this in perspective, if Hyaka were in the asteroid belt, it would be larger than all but the four largest asteroids, after one Ceres, two Pallas, four Vesta, and ten Hygia. In spite of its relatively large size, however, light curve studies suggest that Hyaka is not a gravitationally collapsed spheroid, they further suggest that Hyaka is not tidally locked and has a rotation period of about 9.8 hours. Topic. Mass The mass of Hyaka is estimated to be 1.79 plus or minus 0.11 times 1019 kg using precise relative astrometry from Hubble Telescope and Keck Telescope and applying three-body, point mass model to the Haumean system. Topic. Spectrum and composition The near-infrared spectrum of Hyaka is dominated by water ice absorption bands, which means that its surface is made mainly of water ice. The presence of the band centered at 1.65 micrometers indicates that the surface water ice is primarily in the crystalline form. Currently it is unclear why water ice on the surface has not turned into amorphous form as would be expected due to its constant irradiation by cosmic rays equals equals notes